What is up you guys, it's Nay Rose here, back with another video. So if you're new to my channel, what's up? Make sure you subscribe to my channel, join the family, because if you're not subscribed, then what are you doing? In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to achieve a natural red eyebrow look. I feel like it's a really cute look when you can like kind of match your eyebrows with your hair whenever you dye your hair, or if you have like a weave that's colored. I feel like it'll be cute just kind of like you know, match your eyebrows with it. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do it. I recently dyed my hair red. You can't really tell that good like on camera, but I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys like how it looks in natural daylight anyways. But um yeah, so my hair is red and when I have red hair, I like to have red eyebrows. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how I achieve this look without it being like too much going on, you know, just a little tint to it. Before we even get started, if you wanna see how I got this top knot, I do have a tutorial on my channel, so go ahead and check that out. Make sure that you comment if you, you know, tried this eyebrow routine out and it works for you or if you use different products or whatever the case may be. Let's chit chat in the comments. I wanna know what you guys do. And yeah, let's just get right into this video. So to begin, you wanna make sure that you're starting out on clean skin along with clean eyebrows. And you're just gonna go ahead and take your spoolie, I'm using the one that's on the end of this eyebrow brush that I have, and just go ahead and brush your brows out. I brush mine up and outwards. And then I'm going in with this MAC um, eyebrow pencil, and I will put everything in the description box that I'm using, like the specific name, so you guys know exactly what I'm using. But as you can see, I'm kind of like outlining my brow with the brown, not doing too much, but just doing a light outline with the brown. And then I'm going in with this burgundy colored eyebrow pencil, and it's just from the beauty supply store. Um, it's not a really bright red color, it is more on the dark side, so um yeah it still shows up really good so i'm just going in and adding that to my brow and i don't put it in the beginning of my brow i feel like it doesn't look as natural so i keep the red more towards the end of my brow So you want to go back in and just brush your brow out so that it's blended all together and you can't really tell a distinct difference between the red and the brown. And so um, I realized that it was a little bit too red towards the outer part so I went back in with that brown and kind of filled it in a little bit. So once that's all brushed out and blended out I'm going to go in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer and I'm just taking an angled brush. And I just put that concealer on the angled brush and outline my brow with it. I find that to be the easiest way to get the shape that I want for my eyebrows. So yeah, that works really good for me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and outline it and then move on to the other eyebrow. And also, I like to go over it a few more times just to make sure it's how I want it because I start off kind of thick and then I make it skinnier if needed because it's easier to make it skinnier than making it too skinny and then having to refill back in the parts. Like, that's just too much. <laughs> so, yeah, you always start wide and get skinnier. So leaving your eyebrows with a white outline is not a look, okay ladies? Like, we need to blend, please blend. So I'm taking this brush and I'm just um, blending it out, getting all that concealer blended and not obvious, not noticeable, all of the above. Um, and then I take my beauty blender and I just make sure it's blended out even more. Thank you. 
So after I finish blending it out with my beauty blender, I do an extra step, which is just to put mascara towards the front of my brow. It really just defines the brow hairs a lot more and gives it a more natural look. You can skip this step if you want, but yeah. This is the completed look, you guys. As you can see, I completed my foundation and just added, you know, a little highlight under my brow bone. And out in the sun, I just wanted to show you guys the true color of my brows. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!